is the week that I am finally going to use Tetlifcraft Downtime Full Kit. I've been in love with this kit ever since she sent it to me. I know it's more of a spring kit, but my youngest daughter, Kelani, she actually chose this kit for this week. She is on a vacay with her um, fiance. And yeah, she figured she wanted this one because it signifies her downtime because she's on vacation. She doesn't have to work or do anything because her summer classes actually finished last week. So yeah, she said it would be perfect for her and that she would want me to use it for this week. So yeah, I'm going to do so. So I know I did a kit already with Tetla Craft last week and this was the collab with Amanda and I think it turned out awesome. It really, really turned out great. Yeah, what I noticed in that video, I did not mention where all the stickers came from. I am so sorry. Um, yeah. So back to this week, I am going to have, of course, my kits here and a bunch of other stickers from other shops and my own for the pre-planning. So I am going to do my normal building of the bones of the week. So that will be my um, bottom washi, my glitter headers, and I might put the actual date covers. So yeah, I'm going to go ahead and do that off camera to save some time and I'll be right back. So this is how it looks and I sort of ripped my planner here. <laughs> I didn't rip it through but yeah, I manhandle always everything. So besides that, I really do love how this turned out so far and I'm about to put the date covers but I wanted to show you what I did. I actually took my blank headers that I would made for myself and I just covered up the days of the week. I did so because of how wide or how tall this actually sits up and the date covers are not that wide to cover it correctly. It will leave some on top showing. So I just figured I'm gonna do this for now and hopefully, but I don't want to show it. So I want to take it halfway, but enough. See, it's it's still showing. And I can actually see, I'm not too sure if you can see it on film, but the days of the week are still showing through. But you know what? It is what it is. I am not going to fuss over it more than what I already have been. So that doesn't really look too bad for me. I might actually put some deco going around it to cover it up. But yeah, so far it looks okay and it doesn't really bother me. Put down the full boxes and the gradient boxes. So let's go ahead and do the full box first because I'm actually going to try, try, mind you, to color block. As you saw, I was struggling to pick out my boxes. I always do, and this is why it's hard for me to color block because when the boxes are so colorful like this, I really don't know which one to choose. But I think I did a pretty good job, I think. So just use this here for the top corner so that way it'll match the bottom washi. 
let's just go ahead and go to the ingredient boxes these should be way easier for me to lay down and you don't have to be tortured <laughs> wasn't as easy because <laughs> there's only really one pink peachy tone one to match the header and the rest were just peach tone so it kind of threw me off with this header here but I think I'm okay with it I might switch this one to that one let's do so because I don't know. See, I, I am so sorry. <laughs> Why are you even watching me? I am so... It's not even indecipherable. Well, I am. That's a lie. But it's not even that right now. It's that I really, really suck at color blocking. And it really bothers me that I can't do it. Probably because I'm more random with my boxes not more structured I think that's what I'm trying to say I'm not so structured even in my life I am not this structured um, so for me to actually do a color block spread takes a lot like it's just an energy sucking tool I don't know it just sucks so much out of me I don't know if I'm putting too much pressure on myself. It actually feels like I'm getting anxiety just to put some stickers. This is supposed to be fun for me. But when I am so, like, I don't know, like I feel like I'm messing up, it somewhat bothers me big time. But, yeah. Sorry. But I'm actually putting you through this. So I think I am better off with this one here. I have to just leave it because it's driving me crazy. Let's go ahead and do the sidebar before I go completely loony. I'm going to start off with taking a blank header and try to make it into a flag. Like so, so that way I can cover this flag. Okay, so I just did that for this spot and this spot here. And now we could go ahead and put down I'm gonna try to even it out with the first box. Okay, let's see. Is it crooked? Of course it is. Okay. That's pretty good. So, now I am... I'm so sorry that I'm moving this planner everywhere, but I can't really see it if I don't do it. I can't line it up correctly. I'm going to use the... the this is a blue one. Yeah, why not? So, you know what? I should be just telling you why I haven't uploaded this week until today. I've been having a really rough week. Um, Health-wise. Last, I think it was two weeks ago. Let me see. Well, you didn't see a plan with me because I was upset. But I was going through a major um, bacterial infection. I mean, this might be TMI, but hey, we're all grown-ups here. Um, I found a boil on my right breast. And I'm like, okay, what is this? Usually, you know, you put some hot 
or that hot, scolding hot, but like some as hot as you can take it, cloth or anything, and it'll come up with head and you pop it and it's done and hey, that's it, move on. But this time around, because I've had them before, this time around it really didn't have a head and it popped inside. So, I'm sorry, I'm just trying to see which one, I'm going to go with this one. I actually have two, I'm going to use both of them this week. Can I use the green? You know what? In this sifo. Okay. So, I went to the doctor. This happened on, well, I discovered it Friday night of that week. And I'm like, okay, I'll just wait till Monday. I'll just call my doctor and let him, you know, I'll go in, whatever. So, I've noticed, like, through the weekend that it was turning colors. It was like, almost a yellowish orange it's really weird with like a bruise i'm like wow did i just bruise it did i lean somewhere am i leaving like basically did i lean my chest on somewhere or am i sleeping really hard on it when i sleep on my stomach you know i was like what's what's going on so yeah um i called on monday and let's just use a green one now I called on Monday to my doctor and they like immediately wanted to see me. I went in and he's like, okay, you have a bacterial infection and it's septic. I'm like, what do you mean septic? He said, my boil is septic. So my right breast was septic. It freaked me out because, you know, when I hear septic, I mean septic septic of your intestines and people could die you know and he's like no it's not that type it's just that that bacterial of the boil like the pus and oils and all that instead of coming forming a head and coming out of the body it went into the body and that's what made it septic so needless to say i was like okay um what do I need to do? He said, I'll just give you some antibiotics, really strong ones. Take it four times a day. Do not stop taking them until they are completely gone. So, that's what I did. That's what I was doing every day, four times a day. And let me tell you, it was so... Oh, it was so gross. That pill tasted so nasty. So, I... Regardless how nasty it tasted, I finished it off like a good girl, and so I was like, okay, it should go away, but I noticed that it didn't, and there was like something behind the spot, really big, really hard, and I'm like, okay, this is this, this isn't normal, but then again, I'm on antibiotics, maybe it'll just take it away, blah, blah, blah. So this is for my meds and FaceTiming with my daughter this week, every day, and this is for my dinners. And I actually want one for my, I don't know if it's going to fit, for my Happy Meal. Let's see if it fits. Yeah. So, you know, I was like, okay, whatever, I'm going to see the doctor soon. It's not a big deal don't get all worked up over nothing and since i panic over everything i have anxiety i have panic attacks which sucks and this is getting crooked oh well. anyway so i'm like okay stop thinking the worst just go to the doctor and blah 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 so monday rolled around went to my doctor and he said Okay, okay, I made a mistake. I need to take this out because the only ones I have left of my gradient box are the same color. I don't want two of the same color. So let's move you and put you. Um. So I went and the doctor was like, okay, it's still, did you take all the antibac antibiotic, it's antibacterial, antibiotic, I said, yes, I did, four times a day, just like you prescribed. He's like, well, it's still septic, 
And I'm like, well, that's why the color's still there. I mean, it's not that orangey color so much, but only on a certain spot. And the bruise portion that looked like a bruise, which was the infection, by the way, it was gone, but that part wasn't. And that he noticed also that it's really hard behind the actual boil. And, you know, he says the nodule is probably, you know, big. It's probably nothing. It's most likely a cyst. I'm not sure. But we have to take care of it. We have to look into it ASAP. So he gave me a script to go ahead and get. Did I just do that again? I know y'all must be like, hello, hello, hello. You put the same one back. Oh my god. I mean, I tore that. Oh, this is not going well. I'm so sorry. Like I said, I don't even know why you're watching. <laughs> I'm all over the place. Okay. So by him saying, you know, we have to see, start seeing this. This is like really crooked to me. And I don't understand why. If I'm following it correctly, where did I go wrong? whatever anyway so yeah needless to say he was a little concerned he's like go get um a monogram done and i also want an ultrasound done and i also want a bilateral 3d scan So for Monday's pre-plan and plan, because you know it is Wednesday today, um, I am going to put down that I have my appointment, I have to pick up some meds, and I planned out my week of the 4th of July, and I had a massive migraine. So I think that was it, so I'm going to go ahead and put it down. So yeah, I'll be right back. So that is Monday. I am using a coffee cup from Tricky Sticky Stickers. This right here is, well these two here are from Planet Southern. So yeah, let's go ahead and move on to Tuesday. These stickers are coming up. So for Tuesday, I'm putting down that I went to the farmer's market with my mom. I actually uploaded a Instagram story. I went to Walmart and I went again to Walgreens to pick up some more meds and trash out and a bill is due. So let's go ahead and do that. Tuesday this farmers market sticker and this here is also again from Planet Southern this here is from my own creation and yeah let's go ahead and do Wednesday Wednesday I have film edit upload IG post laundry mission and clean my AC filter so let's go ahead and get started with that and also restart my weekly meds so yeah let's get started
So this is my laundry mission sticker here. I love that this came with the kit because it came out perfectly to have that as a background. So this sticker here is from my planner Envy and film edit and upload is also from Temple Craft. So let's go ahead and get Thursday pre-planned. So for Thursday, I have, um, I'm trying to see if I could go bowling tomorrow if it's not too bad because this would be a really big storm coming so if not I'm definitely going to bring Zachary bowling then I also have movie time with Desiree and a mask time with her as well plus she'll be leaving this night for the whole weekend to do her nanny nanny she's gonna nanny for the weekend all the way from Thursday night to um, Sunday night so she's leaving for that and yeah I have to clean the fish tanks so yeah let's go ahead and get going on that This actually went down a little bit crooked. <laughs> I couldn't fix it. I had to push it out to make room and it's still crooked. But you know what? It's staying just like that. So yeah. This movie marquee is also from Templar Craft. So now moving on to Friday. Friday I have my mammogram and ultrasound appointment. I also want to try to film depending how I feel. I'm not too sure if I don't go bowling I might film and edit to upload for Friday if not then I'll try Friday but I'm not too sure how I'm gonna come out with my appointments so yeah I'm not guaranteeing that I'm gonna have more than just one plan planner I'm not guaranteeing that I have so I'm not gonna guarantee that I'm gonna post so I'm not going to guarantee that I actually am going to post more than just one video this week. So yeah, sorry. But if I can, I will for Friday. So I have two appointments to this day. So I need to go to my mom's house, drop off my son at the same time, um, have coffee with my mom go ahead and go to my appointment at 10 and then I have my mammogram and ultrasound at 2 so that is all that I have for Friday because I don't know how I'm gonna come out of that appointment so yeah let's just go ahead and get it done Okay, so my camera overheated. <laughs> um, I'm not sure if I got any of my Saturday stuff, which I said before is really in nothing going on that I could put down besides Orphan Black because I'm not too sure if I'm going to go either to Six Lives or to a family party. So I was also saying that I forgot to put down that I needed to wax the floor tomorrow night to do that and also I was saying if anyone is also watching Orphan Black please go ahead and let me know down below if you are and if you are tell me who is your favorite character so for Sunday I have down in my notes that I need to pre-plan film and edit and also my top three cleaning which is basically bathroom kitchen and living room Okay, so this is my Sunday. I have here 
a planner little girl from formless design and my film and edit of course from templar craft so yeah i actually added two more things that i need to make sure that are clean and i think that is it i left some room in case i do anything on sunday so let's go ahead and get her open so it's a little bit zoomed in now so you can see better i was planning to do this towards the end that way you can see everything and now let's go ahead and do one of my favorite things and a deco so oh oh i'm gonna actually change this coffee mug so i am going to put this one this one's really pretty it has glitter on it so let's go ahead and change that and i'm gonna go ahead and speed up the rest of this um deco process okay so this is how it turned out it turned out awesome i only have a few deco up here and yeah the rest i am saving for a personal spread also before i forget i did use this little shark week and signifies my menstrual cycle tmi i know but i got it from pookie bear cuties if i forgot to mention any other sticker please go ahead and let me know down below i will surely let you know where i got it from here is the remaining of the kit and as you can see there is a lot left to this kit and i will be using it for my personal spread and most likely there'll be a ton left over as well this is again why i love tent craft full kit she gives you more than enough for a few spreads so yeah if you um definitely love this video and definitely love this kit go ahead and give me a thumbs up it definitely helps my channel and if you're not a subscriber please go ahead and do so you know just click that button down below and don't forget the bell so you'll be notified when i upload again so i have nothing else to say besides i love each and every single one of you don't forget to take care of one another and i will see you in my next video bye bye